Hi everyone, welcome to episode 22, or maybe we'll call it Paralogue Episode 1. Because this is going to be the most straightforward, to the point, we, we, for once, we actually know what we're doing. It's called murder. And the guard's going to be like, oh, you don't make any money in there. That's fine. We don't need it. We're rich. We don't need no stinking money. We just need the EXP pinatas that are down here. We just need violence, not money. It's D effect that we need. All right. So I don't know if y'all can hear me mashing the A button, but, uh... You're gonna be button mashing to oblivion. This is, this is what the episode is. Yep. And us, like, talking. We'll, we'll come up yeah. with something podcasty. We'll, we'll come up with topics as it goes, I guess. Yeah, we were just like, oh, we'll think of something during the break, and... Nothing. Not a thought went through our empty heads. We didn't think of a damn thing. It's a psychic, it's fine. Psychic's dead, cool. Psychic's, it's a, like, what we are doing is we are just gonna go as deep as these training grounds permit us to go. And we're gonna see if it gets worse down there, because I hope it does, because that means the XP will be good. Because we gotta XP. grind out, we gotta grind out like 70, 80,000 XP. And there ain't no montaging this one. Nah. Y'all get to suffer with us. Sorry guys, no speed up montage for you. No, you suffer like the rest of us. I mean, if if I really wanted, I could indeed edit this and just make it quadruple, you could. quadruple speed. But then I'd have to but, render it all. But the other question is, would you want to? That is the question. I mean, to? the actual editing aspect of it would be very, very fast. It's the rendering that would suck. Mm. Yeah, I don't know. Rendering takes, like, forever. Even for something that's, like only a few minutes long yeah i have i have this beast of a gaming pc and rendering still takes me forever all right floor two looks an awful lot like floor one get used to that background floors are the same Except the the monsters are slightly less weak. They're still they're still pretty weak. We're still uh, I'm still winning every fight by just mashing. You know, game. I was hoping you were gonna give us more monsters, not less. Maybe the deeper we go, the more we'll get. Yeah, we're gonna have to hope for that. Just smack them with sticks as we go. We're just we're just running through this dungeon, just wailing on them with sticks. In my case, it's an actual stick. Yep. Oh, we're starting to get into some of the stuff we're seeing in later levels. Ooh, fun. That's good. It's still not good XP yet, but this just leaves me to hope that we're getting there. All right, we've gone from 70 100s to 200 266s. There's a couple of those really... Wow, these things are terrifying when you can see them.
I think I got a good question for you. Sure. What got you into content creation outside of pure desperation? I actually started content creation some 14, 15 years ago. Hmm. I remember seeing a couple of YouTubers and just really enjoying their content. And there were two that stood out. One because I thought his sense of humor was absolutely hilarious. And one because I liked his his gimmick, his concept. Oh, XP's starting to get better. <laughs> the guy whose humor I liked was Lewis Prower. Mm -hmm. And I don't think he does videos anymore, but I remember him and one of his friends, they were playing like Kirby Superstar on the Super Nintendo and they got to the arena and one of the fights in the arena is a joke fight because it's just a waddle dee just standing there and it doesn't do anything he and stands there looking adorable yeah and like you suck him up you spit him out you win the fight but lewis was just like the most fearsome creature waddle dee ah! and he runs into it and gets hit and he's like oh no I, there's nothing left for me to do i'm doomed and then it's just his friends there like he's two frames yeah, but he's ferocious. Yeah, but just just hit this button right here. And he points to the attack button. Right here, he points to the jump button. No, right here, points to the attack button. Right here, points to the up button. Just click them all! And then he starts attacking Waddle Dee and gets Waddle Dee down in health. No, nope, I'm too tired, I can't go on. And then it's just, you're almost there, you can defeat him. But what if he explodes and destroys the whole arena? Just do it, damn it! <laughs> and then finally, Waddle Dee dies. And then, after all that, he's like, It worked! I'm a genius! Everyone hail the great and mighty player Lewis! And just, that tickled me pink to no end. And then the other YouTuber that I'm going to shout out here, who still actively does his thing, uh, guys known as Zeta Plays. And Zeta had this idea that his quest, when he started some 15 years ago, was to play every Nintendo, Sega Genesis, and Super Nintendo game in existence. But instead of doing them in order, he made his thing, he made a thing called the Wheel of Crap which he spins at the beginning of every video and it randomly pulls up a game for him to play. And I have been watching him do this for a decade and change. Back when my financial situation was better, I used to donate to his, uh, I used to pledge to his Patreon, but now I kind of can't afford to do so. But like, like, that guy, I have so much respect for Zeta Plays, because he is... We can't dig past here yet. Wait a while if you can. Oh, he just kicks me out. Eh? He said no mas. Bonk, bonk. So that takes us back to the entrance. Oh. So I guess what's going to happen is we're just going to leave and we're going to come back oh, and no. do it all again. Oh, but we're up to 200,000 XP, so we have been doing okay with the grind. Okay. It's going to take a, it's still going to take a bit. But yeah. And just for fun, because we can. So now we have five buffs on us. Because the other thing I might do is actually, like, hey, let's just go back to the first dungeon and go down to the bottom floor. I mean, EXP fodder. 
Yeah, next time we get you. next time we get kicked out, we're gonna go take a nap and then But yeah, Zeta Flayus is like some 80, 80, 90 percent of the way through because he had like some 4,000 games altogether when he started and he's down to like maybe three or four hundred. Sheesh. He doesn't play them all to completion, of course, because mm. he's not going to sit there and play like Madden Football 87 for like oh, six God. hours. I most, cannot imagine playing that for six hours. No, most most sports games, he'll, like, play, like, two minutes of it and call it good. And that's acceptable to my, by my book. Because there, those games, like, if you're not into sports, you can only make those games entertaining for so long. He also doesn't play through most RPGs because he's just not a fan of, like, streaming turn-based content. He has a couple of exceptions because people make requests, but otherwise, if he's not having fun with it, he does this thing where he'll take, like, the clips of games that he only played for a couple of minutes and compile them into a thing called a fun pack. Um, he is up, he just recently had a milestone in that he put up his 500th fun pack compilation. He has thousands of videos, and there's some, there's still some stuff from his videos from like a decade ago that I still quote on the regular. After we're done recording, I'm gonna have to show you some of his shit because it's actually actually like straight hilarity. Two hundred eyes. Yeah. I'm gonna poke him. We just spoke Poke all, the all of them. Poke the eyes. I'm mashing the A button as fast as I can. There you go. Here's some, uh, some butt mashing ASMR. Here it is. Oh yeah. We're butt mashing, baby. There's the part of me that wonders that if we came in here with a smaller party than six, if there would be more XP, but I don't want somebody falling behind by, like, 60 grand, you know? Yeah. We only went down, like, what, three floors of this, and then suddenly we were kicked out? Yeah. Yep. That's some bullshit. To quote Mooney at this point, because... Quite indeed, some boo sheep. Oh, look! Ninja dogs! Smack them! Bye, ninja dogs. Bye, bye.
we are so entertaining right now. You don't have any idea. <laughs> We're, We're so totally, good. We're totally, totally entertaining. Yep. So, <laughs> Go ahead. that's just a fish. Fish. It's a giant that's magical catfish. catfish. It's dead. Hey, it's free food. Fish doing fish things. We, we slap that on a fire pit, it'll be fine. We'll season I mean, it really true. well. That was the most un actually no, the fact that like those squirrels survived a couple of hits. Hey, it's a tough squirrel. That squirrel said no. Yeah, we just get kicked out. Alright, well, we can take a quick nap, see how far along we've come, and then yeah, we'll see. go to a different dungeon. 55k now. So that was about 15,000. Oh, sure, you leveled up. Yeah. You learned new spells. You gained IQ, you gained one hit point. Oh my god, just one. Yep. Zephyr needs 53,566. Oh, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine! See, you know what would make everything better? Is if this game had one thing that future wizardry games did, where you could just give your money to the church and they'd give you experience points. Uh... I, would, I would just be like, yeah, let's just, hey Raj, give us our money back, and then I'd just be like, here, Zephyr, level up. It's the real, like, mobile game gotchas that make the world go round. <laughs> With money and leveling. Ooh, we got the x-ray spell. Ooh. That's There's actually... an x-ray spell? See what is on the other side of the wall ahead. This is actually really important. Because... One of the spots... Actually, there are a couple of thing places we could use this, I think. Oh, oh yeah, also, just, like, have it me? also, Mooney's, Mo or not Mooney, but Shuri's armor class improved by another point because she leveled again. Yay! So she's a little harder to hit. Actually, hell, here's a... Solid Rock! So we know that on the other side, it just says Solid Rock. This was, like, where there were a bunch of, like... Because if these zombie priests are worth decent XP, this is how we grind. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, 273 is not exciting. Darn. Yeah. This might be a more exciting amount of XP, though.
That's a little better, but I still feel like we could do better than that. I think the proper answer is we go back down to the to the downstairs. We just go into the basement. We go to like where the big monsters are. Yeah. Although there is one potential interesting thing that I feel like we could be doing with this. Mm. And that is that one wall we're supposed to be able to get through because of the ghost lady. Yeah. I want to actually just use the see-through spell just to see if it's like, oh yeah, there's actually supposed to be a, th a, th a thing here. Like there's supposed to be something there? Yeah. Don't care. Bite my shiny metal ass. I mean, whoops, I'm not a robot, beep boop. I mean, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that reminds me of how I was acting earlier this week. There, we'll even throw in the spell that makes us passively recognize secret doors. Alright, so 12-4. That door all the way down there is where we would normally find the thing. So, screw it, let's actually... Wait, actually, how many how many casts of second level? Perfect. So we're gonna try a thing. Oh, oh! It just flat out says there's. Oh, that's fascinating. Okay. I was I was checking the in the the see through spell. Okay to see what would come up if we cast it. Open space? Yep, that is what is beyond that wall. And we can't pass, we can't just like pass through it. Nope. So that's a potential spot where we could go if we grind up enough to where I can actually get the teleportation spell and we go through that door. Yeah, because I would just teleport us right through it. And there are six switches there, and I think those six switches trigger the spot of... Remember how we were supposed to just walk through this one path that says don't turn around? Mm -hmm. It says if you hit all the switches, then this will work. These are the six switches I think we need. Of course it is. Of course it is. Yeah. 
If you haven't given the sweet water the fireflies on floor three, this is as far as you go. If you did, then the inconspicuous room to the south will instead contain the ghost you saw before. She just stands there beckoning without saying anything, but if you press A, or whatever your door opening button is, you'll walk forward through the wall and into the rest of the level. But we were never able to actually give the fireflies, because the fireflies weren't frickin' there. Ugh. So, no. so now we are just wandering. That's just insane. Like, I, I'm, I'm gonna say this, it's just insane how it's like, everything can be so broken at the start. Ah. Yeah, this is, it's, it's a flaw in an otherwise fantastic game. That's fine, I get that, it's just like. It's, I, I'm, I'm irritated too, like, I would like to actually make progress. Please be a big encounter. That I mean, is seven monsters. That's what we need right there. Cast a really powerful fireball spell, Zephyr. You'll feel better. Please. better. We'll go down into the deep, deep down, deep down, deep, Ooh. down, deep, deep down. Only two, but they're 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 more exp, I think. I hope so. Not really. God, I could not imagine handling this game alone, especially if it had a point like this, where everything was just, like, completely busted. With teleport rooms and dark rooms full of nonsense. It's probably a good idea to have, like, a secondary voice just to keep you sane. Oh no, there's no more light. Whatever shall we do? Remember when we were getting like close to like eight enemies in a single wave once? Or nearly eight? Look, dude, I don't care if your mixtape is hot fire. I'm not interested. Never Not mind, interested. you were worth 400 XP by yourself. I'm vaguely interested all of a sudden. Yeah! Oh, it's only one. Okay. 
dude tried to glare at Shuri like it was gonna do something. That ain't gonna do shit. God damn it. Ooh, kill it. Wait, no, 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 no. I shouldn't be disarming. Mooney should be disarming. Mm-hmm. Mooney, you need to get me make the ghost swarm go away. Okay. Yay! More junk for selling. Or possibly future junk for selling. I've just noticed that for the three basic dungeons, you have basic dungeon, dungeon where everybody's a zombie, and dungeon where everybody's a fairy. Yeah. That seems legit. You know what? Fuck it. Let's cast let's cast the summon demon spell. Let's just see what that Ooh. does. We'll yeah, let's do it. We'll cast Sicordi. unaffected. Oh, we now have a demon on our side. Yep. Interesting. A demon named Flack. God, we get enough Flack on the daily. didn't accomplish much of anything. No, you were doors. You were supposed to have encounters behind you. We need the encounters.
That horse has no hey. head. A headless horse. I called the headless horseman, but unfortunately, the guy you're riding it still has a head. But it is quite the headless horse, man. Oh my god. I'm out of it today. Oh my god. Mooney, you have been terribly quiet for a very He's long time. He's muted right now. Oh. She probably had to back away for something. Oh, maybe giant EXP piñata. Nope. Nope. Actually, no. Actually, Nine, yes. 966 ain't bad for a one swing wonder. <laughs> a fucking one swing wonder, man. Ooh, ew. That is a dragon with a humanoid torso and head, and I hate it. I feel very uncomfortable. The fact that it's called an oily dragon. It's dead. Don't worry about it. Th this ain't the muddy grandpa and monster hunter. <laughs> oh, although preferably I, I prefer uh, the bubble dragon instead. I'm real good. I mean, on the positive side, we're at least getting a little bit of map completion done. Yeah. Map completion that we fell behind on. That is... That's an interesting group. That's nine monsters. Okay. Hey, look at that. Maybe we're finally getting somewhere.
Ah, we still got about probably a lot more to go. This dark room sucks. Bad, yeah, cause yeah, it's just a single hallway. We're just snaking in a hallway right now. Not only are we snaking in a hallway, it's a dead end. It's a dead end hallway? some tummy trouble and had to back Aww. away what I miss. Um, you, we miss you. <laughs> that was cute, Zephyr. <laughs> it, it really was. Um. But cuteness aside, what did I miss? You missed us going in on this stupidly long um dark room that Fucking minute. Wait, what? It wasn't a dead end. It wasn't a dead end. No, there was a end. door that I missed. Oh, great! Yay! Backtracking. It's fine. It's fine. Definitely don't sound fine. All right. So, okay. See, see how there's that big long hallway. See where we are? Yeah. If I cast Dumapic right here. There's a dark room, but notice how there's a door. <gasps> a door. Yes. We just gotta make sure we smack into it. It's a door into another dark room. Is this just a cycle of dark room? I wouldn't be surprised. Probably. Unless somehow, and don't quote me on this, unless somehow there is something in here that we can could have used and we didn't even notice. I would lose my mind. I would too. Turn left, check for door. Check for the door. Oh. 
No, I'm backtracking now because nope. it turns out it was still a dead end. Ah. Uh. It's okay. But... We're down here for XP anyway. Yeah, I know. Are their experience isn't bad. Wow, we've been down here long enough that our protection spell wore off. Peace. I mean, the protection spell's doing all right under consideration that, like, uh, we're all still at full health. Yeah. Hmm? Oh, this is the, uh... The book. Oh, this is the one where we take the book, the hallway stops, right? Yep. Okay, so here's the crazy part. We have the book. Yes. That is the Lord Vessel. All we would need to do is get out. Mm-hmm. But there is a rub? Mm. Actually. So here's the thing. When we get teleported back out of the room... Yes. The book gets taken with us. However, mm -hmm. Locked of Fate sends us back to town. So if I teleport us back to town, but we have the book, does that count it as done? Oh my god, could we? Oh, magic is sealed. Oh, fuck, I forgot. <laughs> I thought I was clever. We, I'm not. We, we forgot. Don't turn around. This is fine. This is fine. This is absolutely fine. Except we can't, we have to turn around. I'm assuming you couldn't go through that door that they shoved in front of us. No. Ah, I love it. And hey, you want to know the best part about all this? What? Our magic is still sealed, so we have to get back to town without it. Oh, God. I forgot that happened. I think it was such a bad memory, I wiped it from my own personal memory. The trauma, it was real. Trauma real, man. Yep, alright. One, two, three.
I'm opening doors. Hopefully no monsters come out and attack us. Oh no. Whatever oh, are we gonna no. do? Just whack it with a stick. God, those guys were rich. Very rich. Good Lord. Thirty six K. Thirty five K. Now we gotta go get Hernando. Hernando gotta teach us some things. Yep. And the book is gone. Because of course it is. Iron gloves for Fighter Lord and Valkyrie. More stuff for when I can promote. <sighs> Another angel's flute. We don't Money. need. Dagger of speed. Speed. Interesting. Usable by everybody, but a priest and a bishop can be used by fairies. Hey. hey. <laughs> Interesting. I guess we'll keep that one. Yeah. Durable plates. Also Lord and Valkyrie and Fighter. Which I think we already have one. No, we have best plate, which is better than durable plate. So money. Yep. Interesting. And then iron boots. You've got to be fucking kidding me. Look at all of this stuff I, I'm seething right now because we have oh, no. so much crap. We have so much crap and we can't use any of it, can we? It's either sellable or we can't use it. Can't use it yet. Until I promote. probably don't care about this script. Plate of Warrior! It's only for Samurai. Leather of Ruin! That's probably cursed. And then a that Rod of Flame. Good. Some of this stuff sounds cursed. Yep.
another durable plate, and a staff of fire. I want to say staff of fire? Me? Yep. Fire. And Zephyr use. And pray to God it's not cursed. That staff of fire is in your hands now. Is it better than the other staff? I don't know. We're gonna the have worries, to... The worrisome part is, will it crumble after three uses? Well, that's the thing. We're not gonna use it as, you know, a casting item. You're just gonna hit people with it. Fair. Just whack people upside the head with it because they deserve it. Yeah, just... just freaking hit people that's 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 the that's the real winning play you will feel better that is how it works yeah i like beating people up with sticks okay like i said you will feel We're better not judging you. i will yeah we were we were agreeing with you <laughs> they're exp pinatas yes <laughs> oh god i've gone truly mad at this point Dagger of Speed is actually less valuable than the Psy. Wow. Okay, whatever. We don't need two Plate of Warrior. That's a lot of money. Will you sell me this cursed piece of gear for 2,500 gold? Hell yeah, my dude. Oh, we won't buy it back. It's kind of interesting how he's got, like, so much money to burn just for to give us the money for all these items. Some of them are not cheap. Gold was evenly split. We are now sitting on 20,000 apiece. It's a lot. Oh, God. I wish we had, like, a reliable, easy grind spot that was better yeah. than the training grounds, because 36,000 XP is still a lot. Yeah. There is and we the... get kicked out after the third floor. Yeah. I honestly may actually just do, like, a, a montage video on my own. Yeah. And just kind of grind for a while. Or I might just do the grinding off camera, and then when we come next time we record, I'll just be like, yeah, I did a bunch of grinding off camera, here you go. And, you know. It's one of those things where it's like, it's a, uh, it's like trying to grind Pokemon up the old fashioned way. Yep. Because we need, we need a level, and we need to, uh, we need a level, you need teleport. I need my 7th level spells so I can finally become a lord, and then I will be the tankiest tank. Because I will have Everything. all of that stupid good gear we're holding on to. And actually find a use for it. And actually be able to wear it. Because I'm pretty sure that if I put all that on, my armor class will be stupid. Yeah. And then I'll you, just be... you will probably be in the negative double digits by then. Yep, and it will not show up. It'll just show up as low. Hello. 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 And then if it gets even worse, there is LO and then there's VL. Which is very low. Yep. And then if you get even further beyond that, which is practically impossible, but it does exist, there's EL. Which I'm assuming when you hit the EL, it's like you are near impossible to hit. Yeah, pretty much. You have to be going up against something stupid to hit a negative 50 armor class. Woo! That would be like a modern, like, standard Pathfinder or D&D &D armor class of, like, 70. I see. It would, it would make you just, you would just be like, yeah, you can, you can try to hit me, but you're not accomplishing anything. Yeah. So, yeah, I think what's going to happen here is we're going to call this episode... We're probably not recording anymore today, 
largely because I need to go cook dinner and we have other things we want to do today aside from mm -hmm. mindlessly grind. And what'll end up <laughs> happening is I'm just gonna grind out like a hundred thousand XP or some such off camera. And then the next time we record, it'll be like, hey guys, we're about to do the level up thing for everyone and it'll be great. Mm. That, that might be a good like starting point. Yeah, because we'll get the teleport spell and then we will be able to finish two dungeons. Ooh, and then we'll be able double dip. And then we'll be able to actually do regular dungeons the way they're meant to be done. And oh, it, hopefully we'll sound a little less like we're tired. Yeah. And then, hey, you want to know the fun part? You know how we've had this one guide up the whole time? Yeah. It doesn't have the other three dungeons, so we it have to doesn't? do... It doesn't? Nope. So we would be doing it all blind. Oh, the fun! Tr the true wizardry experience. Oh, <laughs> God, we're going to die. Yep. Yep. This, but is, this is not a case of anyone take the wheel. This is a case of, oh, my God, what is going to happen? <laughs> Jesus taking what wheel now? But yeah, that's uh, that's going to be the course of action. And it's fine because it means that I have a week before our next recording. So I have plenty of time to grind this out. It's grind time, baby. We will save here and we'll save here and I'll make multiple save files. So that way I can like I will ensure that we get the levels, but I won't actually like commit to the levels until we can all see them so it'll be fun mm -hmm. we'll make it fun we will we're just gonna Sometimes. we're just gonna i'm just gonna i'm gonna do this off camera not recorded not subject mooney and zephyr to it i'm gonna take one for the team and by one i mean like forty thousand. yeah it's fine actually it's okay. just 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 for my own sake, just to see how much we're going to go take a nap one last time. And I'm even going to write down how much XP that we need to level everybody up once. I know for sure it's going to be a ton because she just leveled. Yep. 36,719. Ninety six thousand one hundred and thirty. Sixty one thousand seven hundred and one. I'm actually doing a thing real quick, so don't mind me. Mm hmm. Mooney needs only 31,268, so that's not terrible. That's good. Forty-seven thousand six ninety-seven. Five, four, two, six. All right, so now I know the numbers, the magic numbers that I need to hit for everyone. The highest is going to be 303,075 for Shuri, and that'll get yeah. everybody else at least one as well. So, yeah, don't mind me. I'm just going to grind 96,000 XP off camera. <laughs> don't mind me. If I get really sick of it, I'll probably stop at 61k, or if I get really, really sick of it, 47k. But 35,426 is the absolute un, like, non-negotiable, I need this. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. And then when we come back for episode 23, 
It's gonna be, it's, we're just gonna open with leveling, and it's gonna be great. <laughs> At least I hope it's gonna be great. It'll be fantastic. I think it'll be fantastic. It better be worth it, because otherwise I'm gonna be really frustrated. Oh, oh no. And then... I'm also gonna go ahead and just make this statement here. If we get the teleport spell, and the teleport spell does not work, and we can't finish the two dungeons, I'm gonna go ahead and just be like, yeah, we're just gonna end the series. Because if the game's busted and we can't finish it, then so be it. Though there is the part of me that wants to be like, I wonder what would have happened if we started with a different dungeon. But it's it's a little frustrating that there is a possibility that we can't do the dungeons in order. Yeah. So we'll figure out what it is, but I'm I'm dedicated. I'm either going to grind out the XP we need to force our way through this, or I'm going to, uh, you know, we're going to put in our best effort and be like, yeah, the game's poorly programmed. And then we move on to a different wizardry experience. Which is fair. One of them things. But and it's, it will be something that's technically out of our hands. Yep. But we'll have we'll we'll be able to have said that we tried, and then we'll just move on to a different game if we need to. I have yeah. so many wizardry games. We can make this work. Yeah. So, anyways, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for being patient with us. And uh, don't forget the the links. You thought that I had forgotten. You thought that I wasn't going to say anything about the links. Go click them. Right now. Go click them. Go click them and we'll consider starting up a different wizardry game. Or we'll consider starting up this one some more. Whichever. We'll make it work. We will give you what you want. Just trust in me. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> we'll, we'll see you next game. Bye, folks. Bye.